This lesson will describe how to ensure the different data types are fully linked to each other. The Tuffman philosophy of linking different data types is described in a lesson under the overview of the Tuffman system. To recap, in order to compare log sheet data for a particular trip with other types of data collected, there needs to be a link made between each of the other types of data. Likewise, the linking of port sampling data need to be made to the other types of data, for example observer data, fishing trip and port visit log, and unloadings data. The overall links that are made between each database makes for a very complex diagram. Although these links can be made in a very straightforward manner in Toughman, and this complexity is very much transparent to the user. There are two ways to ensure that all data are linked. The first is to manually enter the data links in the boxed drop-down menus in the header section of the data entry screens. This particularly applies when entering log sheet, unloadings, vessel activity and observer data. The second way to ensure that the data are linked is to run the post-entry processing facility in Toughman. This facility will automatically make the linkages when the selected linking processes are run. Refer to the lesson on post data entry processing for the details of these linking processes. It is strongly recommended that even if the links have been manually entered that the post entry processing facility is used as a backup. Use the Toughman data quality report number 2 to reconcile trip log, log sheets, port sampling and unloading data for the longline fishery. If these data sets are not linked, then it is virtually impossible to pick up inconsistencies in reported fish catches. Poor data quality in any of these data sets will lead to errors when they are used in stock assessment and for reporting to the, to the WCPFC. Other data quality reports will check on links between different data sets. These are covered in detail in the lessons on reporting data quality coverage. That concludes this lesson.